Alright, hello and welcome to this very short video that is going to show you how to scan stuff without making a HP account that nobody wants. I just got this HP printer because my Canon one down here has recently stopped working. Uh, the left side of the rollers just don't work. The right side's fine, so little tiny poster tables come out, but the left side, nah, it just does not pull paper in. Uh, but this one was free, so I'm not going to complain. It was free off Facebook Marketplace. It looks relatively new, and <coughs> it works to an extent. I'm waiting for new ink because the current ones don't do anything. But, other than that, free printer. Now, I went to see if the scanner worked. Let me just get my laptop. I went to see if the scanner worked. My logic to do this was to go into the HP Smart app and see what would happen, right? There's a scan option in here on my phone, and there is on here as well. So I went over here to scan, and guess what? You have to make an account. Click and close. You, you don't get the option not to. So, yeah, that's pretty stupid. But the way I solved this problem was to go into your start menu and type in Windows Fax and Scan. Yep, going back to the Vista days. <laughs> this is an ancient program, but it does still work. And if you go to New Scan in the corner, you can go ahead and choose your options without having to make a bloody HP account. So we're going to do Document. And we're just going to do it in colour because this is a legacy app and it's not very good for touchscreen. Scan. There you go. Haven't got to make a bloody HP account. Okay, it's done. It's sideways, but it's done. And there's my document. Hello world. I'm just going to go ahead and view. There it is. I can rotate it and... uh well, there you go. Ignore that, that's just ink, but yeah. Um, that's a very short and easy way to bypass HP's rubbish, give us your information to scan a document, aka do the bare minimum. So um, just use the Vista Fax and Scan app. <laughs> Hope this helps somebody.